Lashley is one of Tasmania's most successful local race car drivers. In 13 years of racing, he has won over 100 races and 6 state titles in the HQ Holdens category. Phil caught the racing bug off his late brother who began racing HQs in 2006. Phil bought his own in 2008 and began racing the following year. In 2010, he won his first race at the last round and finished fourth in the state championship. The following year, however, would be a breakout year with more race wins and Phil's first state championship. In 2014, Phil bought his now legendary Yellow HQ and since then has racked up a further 98 race wins and five state championships. Despite a well-prepared car, the race wins didn't come easy. Phil had to work for them and subsequently has become a formidable racer that just doesn't give up. This clip with original commentary perfectly sums up Phil as a racer. Uh, probably got the better of it as they head up to the Tilford Auto Group Bridge for the first time. Ashland tries to push his way up in there on the inside up through turn number one. Can't get there. And I think for the first time, Corbel has so uh, he's given him some room. Ashland pushes, Corbel pushes. And I tell you what, Ashland, just because he just absolutely refused to be beaten to the corner, got it done. At the end of last year, Phil felt like he had achieved all he could with the HQ and wanted another challenge. So after watching local group end races, Mick Cross and Scott Caldwell throw their Tiranas around the track, Phil bought an LJ Tirana Group NC race car. With the team's experience with 202 powered Holdens, the Tirana was a logical choice. Since purchasing the LJ from the mainland, the team has installed a new dual master cylinder setup, new front springs, a new front sway bar, adjusted the ride height and installed a new side exit exhaust. So far, Phil has run the car competitively once at Simmons Plains and once at Baskerville and has already got within a few tenths of the fastest Group NC Tirana lap times at both tracks. Simmons Plains meeting earlier this month, Phil put on a driving clinic and managed to beat much more modern and sophisticated cars in a combined field. as one of the fastest group and combinations in the state. At the Baskerville Historics in September, Phil is eager to test himself against Australia's best in the Group N Tirana only race to see how he compares. It's a race not to be missed.